What's going on everybody? Welcome back. My name is Adrian and today I'm playing Luggage. This looked like a pretty interesting game. What? You... You hear something coming from the suitcase behind me? <laughs> Don't worry about it. What a rough trip that it is. Get up from sea. We C. arrived in Los Angeles. Thank you for flying Hubris Airlines. Thank you for flying me. I'm getting up. Last out of the plane, and I can't even go back there to see what the deal is. Am I? Is this first what class? What am I going to tell Jessica? Whatever you tell her, you better lower the volume when you do. You might blow out her eardrums like you just did mine. She will never forgive me. Sorry, I'm being a little mean. I like that. Don't the oh. your luggage, sir. You should see it on your way out. Thank you, airport staff. Why do you have that lifeless, cold, dead look in your eyes? I don't, I don't understand. I, I was gonna say, the fact that there's actually voice acting, good move. And this is big, dude. It looks like a legit airport. But where's the baggage claim? I see three, the triplets, quadruplets. Oh my God. <laughs> More triplets. And where did I... Go to Twin City. You shut the fuck up. Sorry, that was a uh, that was a horrible joke. What's back here? My exploratory nature makes me want to check. I can't go in. My exploratory nature has not been quenched. And the music is very interesting. I'll say that much. Not that. Now, how do I know which one is mine? That scales luggage. What am I gonna tell the cops when they find out he's missing? Can I? Can I take it? What happened? This isn't mine. This isn't mine. This isn't mine. So what there the hell? There my luggage. Oh, thank you for telling me. I'm grabbing Maybe you. Maybe use a payphone to call a taxi now. Can't wait to get home. I'm so confused. Do I go out this way? Is there a payphone over here? Maybe. This is pretty neat, man. It's very fleshed out. I gotta say. Okay, I'm calling a taxi. Hello? I need a ride home. I'm at the Hubris Airport. Sure thing, sir. May I get your name? Steve. Steve. A cab will be on its way. Awesome, dude. It's all going according to plan. I have a feeling that there's a dead body in my luggage. I don't know why I get that feeling, but I do. I'm gonna go to the exit. How do I leave? Oh. Immediately it happens for me. Okay, well more triplets i also have to say i feel like the voice of the main character sounds a little familiar to me what are you queuing up for there's nobody there these people are just brain dead zombies with no actual frontal lobes <laughs> he did not he did not like what i had to wow, say that was quick i was gonna say the voice kind of sounds like jar red gaming i don't know if that's the case and if it's not, then whoever's doing the voice, your voice sounds very similar to Jar Red Gaming. I'm going in. Oh. I've arrived. Do I have any mail? I don't have any mail. I'm going upstairs and I'm hiding this body and I'm going to figure out what to do. I, I know. Home sweet home. Man, I regret camping with Gail. Knew it was a bad idea. Okay, so. I think my suspicions are being clarified right now. Did I leave Till the- this day, the killer was never found. The neighborhood of Ellendor was left in shock. A man in his 60s found dead at his front lawn. But that was only his body. His head is yet to be found. The killer likely took it as a trophy. A manhunt was underway for the unknown killer. Oh my god. With the only description of him looking like a camper. That was the only witness description of the killer. With what the police knew of him, they searched the woods near the neighborhood for any campsites. Police have reports of an airplane passenger who left the country matching his description. Oh god, wow. What a surprise. It's me. I'm the killer. How he got the severed head through airport security remains a mystery. I'm never going to tell you Halloween that. in 1970, a man was butchered at his home. 
Okay, I think it's just repeating. Till Let's day, continue. Can I shut you off? Found. Please? No? Okay. So I'm guessing this takes place during the 70s then. I mean, it makes sense if you look at the way this apartment is decorated. It's very 70s. Let's go into the bedroom. What do I do? How do I make this work? Oh, here we go. Unpack my luggage. Oh, is it putting me back at the scene of the crime? What I the like fuck? it. Am I reliving this nightmare again? I guess so. Well, what was I thinking? Hello? Who are you? Are you playing hide and seek? What? All right, I'm very confused, but I like the direction this is going. I wish I'd never thought about it. I should have just cut the firewood and went back to camp. Wait, is that me? Or is that the ghost of the other? Okay, well, whoever it is, it's gone. All right, I guess I go back to the camp then. Interesting. Why? Just why couldn't I let the past be and moved on? I don't know, but I'm following my ghost. Get out of here. Oh, oh what just happened? Okay. And oh, what no. am I? Oh. oh. I'm so sorry, Gail. I'm sorry. Okay, well, that's a direct answer right there. Immediate answer. How can I live with myself? I'm a monster. Yeah, you are. Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. What's happening here? Why is this happening? Am I following? I'm following my ghost. My ghost is trying to get where are we headed. What is that? Is that a cliff? Dude, could you maybe hold on a second? Could you maybe explain a little bit more what is happening here? Oh, this is weird, man. Hey, buddy. Hey, I accidentally turned on sticky keys because of you, okay? Uh, uh, please. Let me know what the deal is. I'm so confused. I'm going to do it this time. I'm going to kill myself. Maybe that's why I'm here. Um, I have no control over this right now. Okay. Well, a rather dark way to end a game. It was Jar Red Gaming. I knew it. Ha <laughs> ha. Not bad, though. I like the direction that this took. It was very interesting. It had like a lot of, I guess, fleshed out elements to it, especially the airport. That really took me by surprise, like how actually detailed it was. In all honesty, though, I thought the story was going to go a little bit deeper. It ended very quickly and abruptly, but I still think that for what it is and for how much is in the game already, it does well. It almost had like this noir feel to it also with the music and just the overall feel of the game. So that was another plus. I thoroughly enjoyed this. This was a great experience. Anyway, if you guys want to try this out for yourselves, as usual, be sure to check the link down below in the description. Otherwise, that's going to be it for me. Thanks for watching, everyone. I appreciate you all for being here, for showing me your support. If you happen to enjoy this video, hit that like button down below. Leave me a little comment. Let me know how you feel. And if you're new to the channel and you like what I'm doing here, please consider subscribing. It really helps me out a lot. Once again, I thank you all so much for watching this video. I can't wait to see you all in the next one. Take it easy. Thank mm -hmm. you.